And by the way, what, what I'm asking usually is uh, pause recording. Okay. So welcome to our course, Introduction to Numerical Optimization. And uh, so I show the the main homepage of the course is here. Yes, it's my my old Google homepage. There, are, there, are, there will be an announcements on Moodle, and uh, I also invite you to join this uh, Google group. We we need to resolve some technical issue for some reason. It, it's not working yet, and uh, also to join WhatsApp. WhatsApp is uh, very active group and uh, this is only a re orientation meeting so uh, let me say a few words about the course uh, okay so we, we, we use a flipped classroom uh, this is the longest course in the technical this flipped classroom maybe something like more than, than 15 years and uh, so the video are available on YouTube or on Course Era, so you can join. Uh, it's a good idea to join also Course Era. Here is uh, the link, and here is invitation. Here are two links on Course Era, <clears throat> but also videos are on YouTube. So I will publish the links if you have some problems with Course Era. So students watch uh, videos at home, <laughs> and uh, in class we, first of all, we do very short quiz usually in the beginning of the class, something like five seven minutes, just do, uh, to be sure that students watched the videos. It's good stimulus to watch, and uh, and then we discuss the lecture and solve problems and uh, like uh, is uh, written here uh, students watch uh, discuss the lecture and solve problems in zoom class and uh, active participants uh, will get bonuses uh, i mean what we usually do students solve the uh, problem which we present in, in class and show solution and I even encourage you if you are able physically to sit with a pair or so three students together in one room in one physical room <clears throat> or otherwise uh, everybody sits in its own but you should have your own personal con communication and I, I actually encourage students to solve uh, problems together in, in small groups. And then uh, somebody presents, on, and those who present uh, get some some small bonus. We will still de 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 decide what what amount of this bonus will be. It's something like zero three points uh, towards final grade, something like that. And uh, also we have uh, homeworks. Here you see the number seven homeworks. Uh, it's to be on safe side. Quite often we reduce it a, li a little bit. Beat it maybe six or even five. Depends on how it goes. And this is 15% of, of the grade. And uh, many of them are practical, so you you uh, you should uh, implement uh, algorithms in MATLAB or Python. It's most uh, recommended, but if you love some other software tool, uh, you're, you're welcome. Uh, uh, but uh, also, af after you did ev ev everything, then you show, for example, your program on computer screen, and even run it and do video screen recording with your oral comments. And this, even if you do in pair, 
the recording uh, is must for each one to do separately. Why? Because if you explain, you learn. So if your friend explain, you learn less. And uh, one more thing, there will be mutual peer review. So you 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 will put grades to each other with some soft manner. We already have this experience. Uh, last uh, last year so usually students check couple of homeworks in this way each pair get, get four feed, feedbacks which is rather good and one more very important thing of uh, checking the homeworks of others you learn people learn from others Students learn from others. If you see how others, uh, other students do this work, you 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 get uh, better knowledge. And uh, final exam, which is eighty five percent of of the grade, uh, part of uh, final exam will be taken from this uh, relatively long list of questions. I, I will click now. Let's see whether we will see it. It's loading. Oops. Okay. So when you watch uh, videos at home, it's very good idea even to write down answers to those questions if you are well training, trained during year. So they may be part of the exam. You have no obligations to put it exactly in the same form, but there will be very large chance that those questions are will be part of exam and maybe some additional exam, some one or two new problems. So it's uh, very encouraging because they are well structured and if you check yourself, then you are able to answer them, then your, your probability of getting good grade in exam is rather high. And uh, why I like this, because I was student in, in Soviet Union, and uh, we, we, we had the usually oral exams, and in oral exam, you get in advanced list, like 100 questions, and when you learn this list, it really uh, organizes your knowledge uh, very well. Actually, I I, sh I, sh I should say you because uh, things are developing uh, in the beginning. Just let, let, let me switch back. In the beginning, <coughs> some years ago, when the group was relatively small, uh, in, in addition, we could give less uh, problems on exam. But instead of there was oral defense of homework, of your MATLAB homework, then you should run and show me or to assistant how they run, comment and so, so on. We may, we may keep this uh, opportunity open. It's not uh, decided finally. Okay. And uh, I hope that you already watched uh, today uh, towards today meeting uh, those two the very introductory we don't have uh, tutorials on those two lectures here are just example of optimization problems and here a refresh of linear algebra because we use we do use linear algebra in our course it's a uh, very good uh, for students to refresh and I, I should say you also this uh, to know linear algebra is very good and uh, actually I, I would say it, it almost half of uh, usefulness of this course that you get uh, acquainted with the linear algebra you get used to linear algebra tools which are now the main tool in science and engineering everywhere. Okay.
I think uh, this is more or less and the Ah, okay, and and we also have uh, our course uh, error site, and uh, here the material is split by weeks. On week one, you have this introductory. But by the way, you you have some old zooms and tutorials. It's not obligatory. What the uh, obligatory? It's only the lectures themselves. And uh, on uh, week two, on week two, uh, we start already diving in derivatives, first and second derivatives, gradient and Hessian of multivariate functions. And uh, you are mainly expected to, it's one lecture on YouTube, but for your convenience on uh, Coursera, they are split in nice chunks. Uh, until this lecture on Jacobian. Uh, this lecture on Jacobian, it will be not part of our meetings and tutorials because it's too much for, for meetings, but it will be part of uh, one of homeworks. So when you will get this home, you 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 can watch it in 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 advance, but it's not must at, the, at, the, at this point. At, the, at this point, <coughs> you you see, I I have also list of YouTube uh, videos. So at this point, lecture two three is uh, obligatory, which has corresponding parts on uh, course error, and also I explain how to check numerically. Uh, gradients in, in Hessians is for your future homework, but it's very useful uh, to see this uh, rather short video because it organizes it organizes your thinking rather well. Uh, okay, I think it's uh, more or less. Now you, you can ask your questions, please. What about the, the the video on the neural networks? Is it the, should we watch it also? Uh, again, it will not be part of tutorial. Mm -hmm. It will be part of later uh, your later homework. If you have capacity to watch it now, it's very useful. But then you will uh, return to the, it's just very brief in, uh, introduction. I have two videos on new neural networks, and one of them got uh, hundred thousand views, viewers. So I think that I uh, explain not bad the introduction to neural networks, despite that now is deep learning era, and every student know new new neural network because before coming to me, this was <laughs> like. 15 years ago, and it was unusual. It was before the deep learning boom. Okay, yes. So I, I hope I have answered your question. Okay, so if uh, you don't have a... Uh, 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 and uh, one more Im Im important thing. In the end of uh, every meeting, of every Zoom meeting, uh, we will have a reception hour. It's very con co convenient. Maybe I will stop, uh, stop uh, recording now, and you also can stop. Uh, just pause.